what's in my kids boo baskets for 2022 so if you're new here hi my name is Brittany I do have three girls Layla who is a Aurora who is four and Jade is going to be two this coming October so I have my kids boo baskets all laid out right here and I am dying to share what I have in them this year as always make sure you check out the description down below because I will have links to their baskets as well as everything that I put in them so first we'll start off with my daughter Jade who will be two in October so I'm going to go from youngest to oldest so this is what her basket looks like these baskets are from Target I've had them now for I think this is our third year with them now and I love them they are just perfect for boot baskets because they're so wide and it stays open they're just the perfect size I can fit so much stuff in here so this is what Jade's looks like so the first thing that I got Jade is a blanket i got this from home goods it's so cute i'll try to find it for you guys but it's been out of stock for weeks now so i'll try to track it down but it's a light pink and then it has which is all over it i think this is just like the perfect girly halloween blanket so the first thing in jade's basket is a sticker book so i got this off of amazon it's called on a spooky halloween night and this is a sticker activity book so there's over 500 stickers in here so there's different halloween theme scenes on one side and then the other side has all of the stickers so your child can create the scene however they want my kids really love activity books like this so i think they are going to die when they see this it has a ton of different cool scenes in here and like i said there's over 500 stickers books like this are also really great for traveling like if you're on an airplane if you're bringing like a backpack and you're able to fit this in there or if you're going like on a road trip if you're going to be in the car for a while things like this are amazing next are some gel clings the girls like to decorate their bedroom windows also the window in the playroom they like to decorate it so I figured they would like this. This one was from Target and this was $2. They also had different types. I think they had like one that had ghosts, one that had skeletons. And then I also got her a book. Something I always put in my kids' boo baskets is a book. So this one is Jade's. Like I said, she's going to be two in October. So I got her a Countdown to Halloween board book. We also have the regular Halloween book from this same author and we love it so i figured we would also love the countdown one so it just has a countdown from 10. it also has some cool ideas in here too to do with your kids to get excited for halloween as you count down the days so for example this one says eight days until halloween and we bake creepy cookies and then it says seven days until halloween and we paint pumpkins so i thought this book was really amazing because i can also use this as a guide on what to do with my kids as soon as it hits like really close to halloween because we can do the countdown i also got her a squishy i don't know about your guys's kids but mine are obsessed with squishies right now every single time we step foot in target we somehow end up in the toy section and my kids are always looking at the squishies so i was on the hunt for these these were originally in i think it was like walgreens and everybody was going crazy over the squishies I believe they were only around like $15, $10 when they were in Walgreens, but I could not find these this year. They were just out of stock everywhere, but I was able to track them down on Amazon. Unfortunately, they were like $25, so definitely ended up spending more on these, but I just couldn't pass them up. You guys know Nightmare Before Christmas is my favorite movie. So I think the girls will really like these. Next are some boots. I always put boots in my girls' boo baskets too. They had these same exact ones last year and they held up all fall and winter. And they wore these every single day in fall and winter. They held up so good and these are really inexpensive. They're kind of like Doc Martin dupes, which I absolutely love Doc Martens, but I just cannot justify paying that much especially on kids shoes because their feet grow so fast so 
I just love the look of these ones. Next are some squishies. These came in a three pack from Target. I also put these in my girls' boo baskets last year and they really love them. So I figured I would grab some again this year. I also threw in two of these like pumpkin eggs. They're kind of like Easter eggs, but pumpkin shaped. I don't have anything in them right now. That is the last thing that I need to go out and buy for my kids for their boo baskets is like candy like snacks like treats stuff like that that's the only thing i'm missing actually that's not true so the other thing that i'm waiting on is like a halloween themed play-doh kit that somebody is sending me she's also going to be sending me a coupon code for those play-doh kits so make sure you follow me over on instagram so that way you don't miss the play-doh because i will definitely be sharing that over there as well as the coupon code so anyways back to these like i said i don't have anything in this so i have to go out and buy some treats and then the last thing that's in jade's basket are these wooden little pictures that she can paint this came in a big set but i just opened it up and i split it among the girls my girls really like to do crafts so i always like to put a craft in their boo basket too so i picked out the little ghost for jade and then the cat and pumpkin she's really into cats she's always meowing so i figured she would like these two so that is everything in jade's boo basket so next up is aurora's boo basket so aurora is my four-year-old she'll be five in december so here's what her boo basket looks like so the first thing for Aurora is her blanket. So I got her a blanket from Target. This is the Hide and Eek Boutique. This was $10, I believe. So she asked me for a skeleton blanket. So that is exactly what I got her. It just has skeletons all over it. And then I also got her a pair of boots. These are the same exact brand as the ones that I got Jade. And then I also got her a squishy. So I got her... Sally. I also got her some squishies, but I put the cat one in her basket and the skull. I also have some of these pumpkins in here. And then for her wooden painting little things, tombstone with a ghost, another tombstone, but this one has a bat and a spider, and then another tombstone with a pumpkin. For her book, the one that I got her is The Little Ghost Who Was a Quilt. I've been seeing so many people talk about this book on TikTok. I really like the illustrations in this book too. So I picked out this one for Aurora. I also got her the same gel clings. And then I also got her the same sticker book. So that is everything in Aurora's basket. So last up is Layla's basket. Layla is my eight year old. She'll be nine in November. So here's what her basket looks like. So Layla's blanket has bats all over it. Again, it's from Target. And then for her squishy, she got Jack. And then I got her three of those pumpkins too. I also got squishies for Layla. So she got a skull and then she got a pumpkin. For Layla's craft, painting craft, I chose the witch's cauldron for her and then a haunted house with a ghost. And then for Layla's book, I chose the spider and the fly. This one looked really interesting again because of the illustrations. That's what caught my eye. I'm a sucker for like vintagey, like old style looking illustrations when it comes to books. So I thought this one was just super interesting. It kind of gave me like Adam's family vibes. So I think this book is going to be a really good read. She also got the same gel cleans and then the same sticker book. So that's everything in the girls' boot baskets, but I have something else to share. So aside from the Play-Doh that I'm still waiting on for their boot baskets, this is the last thing that I got for the girls. So this is from Lush. This is a haunted house tin and I have cool bath bombs in here. It smells so good, I can already smell it. So I guess I'll show you guys my bath bomb that I got because it's in here too. 
So I chose Ghost Face for my bath bomb. And then I think this one is going to be for Jade. So it's a mummy. And then the pumpkin is going to be for Layla. And then this ghost is going to be for Aurora. But that is everything in my kids' boo baskets, you guys. Make sure you're following me over on Instagram so that way you guys can see the Play-Doh kits when they come in. And I'll share that discount code with you guys as well if you guys want to grab them for your kid. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out the description box down below again because I'll have links to everything. And let me know what you guys are putting in your kids boo baskets. If you even do boo baskets, if you celebrate Halloween, what are you guys going to be for Halloween? Let me know all the things Halloween because it is my favorite. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.